Thanks, Emily. Look at this, an incredibly close call on a Ferris wheel at a mid-state fair. A teenager found herself dangling from her seat when her cart suddenly flipped. Amazing that she wasn't hurt. Well, our Nick Barris says investigators think they now know how it happened, but the big question is, could it happen again? Come on up. We're talking about a situation on this Ferris wheel where the swivel on the cart malfunctioned. The person riding on it had to hang on to the safety bar for dear life. This is a photograph from the scene showing the cart upside down. It happened Friday at the Warren County Fair. The teen and her boyfriend are still too shaken to talk on camera, according to the boyfriend's father. But he told us by phone his son says the two were riding the Ferris wheel when the cart suddenly lurched. The boy hung on, but the girl was tossed from her seat and barely managed to grab a safety bar dangling in the air for some 30 seconds before amazingly falling safely to the ground. Uh, we take it real serious. That very same Ferris wheel is now part of the Midway at the Coffee County Fair. Bob Warren, vice president of the fair board, was concerned to hear about what happened. And that's why we try to double check and triple check everything. But fair and carnival rides are always inspected. So how did this happen? How does a Ferris wheel cart just suddenly flip? Russ Kissel, the owner of Kissel Entertainment, which operates the rides, declined an interview with me. But he did release a statement saying that they found that a previous rider had tampered with a secondary safety pin that holds the hair guard in place. He says the tampering caused the flip and that they are now immediately revising our inspection process. I just think it was a freak accident. Coffee County's Warren says the Ferris wheel has already been inspected and will likely be every single day this week. And what about the safety pin on the Ferris wheel Kissel says was tampered with? They double secured the pins where they, you can't take them out got to have tools to take them out with now. So that Ferris wheel will be open for business on the Midway this week at the Coffee County Fair. Nick Barris, News Channel 5. Uh, neither teen was hurt in that incident. No reports were filed with the Sheriff's Department, but the father of the boyfriend says he still has some questions and does plan to look into more, more exactly as to what happened.